coming in on the Facebook Live. I want to welcome all of those also whose name that we cannot see and also whose names that we can see. Remembering that this is the day that the Lord hath made and we shall rejoice in it and be glad. I want to say good morning to our intercessors and good morning to our God seekers. Good morning, Sister Kendall. God bless you. Good morning, Sister Sharon, Sister Tara Lynn. Good morning. Good morning, Sister Giovanna. Good morning. Good morning, Sister Robin. Sister Steph. Good morning, Sister Belinda. Good morning. Sister Janice. Good morning, Sister Teresa. Sister Deborah. Sister Teresa. Sister Magna. Lady Susan. Good morning. Sister Tanya. Sister Trina. Sister Shikari, good morning. Sister Janice, Sister Valerie, Sister Betty, Sister Ada, Sister Yvette, good morning. Sister Doris, good morning. Sister Tabitha, good morning. Still praying for your father. Good morning, Sister Yolanda from Memphis, Tennessee. Good morning. Praying also for the Boyd family in Tennessee. God bless you. Good morning, Sister Kim. Good morning, Jimmy. Good morning, Evelyn. Good morning, Brother Sheldon. Good morning, Sister Debbie. Good morning, Sister Bowers, Sister Barbara Bowers. Good morning, Sister Monica, Sister Cheryl, Sister Kaylin. Good morning, Sister Wanda, Sister Patty, Sister Dewana, Mother McCroy, Sister Yvette, Sister Veronica, Sister Daphne, Mother Nancy. Good morning, Sister Jean, Sister Lorraine, Sister Kathleen. Good morning, my sister Esther. Good morning, Sister Kathy, Sister Tanya, Sister Teresa, Sister Patricia, Sister Lorette, Sister Steph, Sister Arinda, Sister Rudy Ann, Chav, good morning, June, Catherine, Dr. Hampton, good morning. Good morning, Sister Wanda. Good morning, Brother Clark. Good morning, Sister Elma. Good morning. Good morning, Sister Gigi, Sister Irene, Sister Daphne, good morning. Sister Carol, good morning. Good morning, good morning, good morning to everyone. To those that are still coming in also on the prayer line, we want to say good morning to you. Good morning, Kendra. Good morning, Dr. Longmire. As we are preparing ourselves, good morning, Sister Jordis, Sister Mary, Sister Jan, good morning. Good morning, Sister Jesse. Good morning, good morning, good morning. Good morning, thank you. I want to thank you, Sister Kia. Good morning, I want to thank all of you for uh, sewing into this hour. I never want to take it for granted, um, the seeds that you sow. God bless you. And thank you for mingling your intercession with other intercessors at this fourth hour prayer watch. Good morning, Sister Janelle, Sister Lorraine, Sister Judith. Thank you, thank you, thank you. I want to begin, I want you to begin to position yourselves as you come in. And as we position ourselves to war with our hands and fight with our fingers, we are strategically fighting in cyberspace. We are commanding, directing, and prophesying into our mornings and the mornings of others in cyberspace for positive outcomes based upon the word of God. Good morning, Sister Claudette, Sister Mona, Dr. Sims, good morning. We declare what the Bible says before we even open our mouths to pray. And that is that I will make my prayer unto God and he will hear me. And this is the confidence that we have in him. The confidence we have in him is that if we ask anything according to his will, he heareth us. And if we know that he hear us whatsoever we ask, we know that we have the petitions that we desire of him and we shall decree a thing and it shall be established unto thee and the light shall shine upon thy way i want you to hear this directive word but i feel also um, to pray for those or to remind you to pray for those that are grieving on this morning um, praying for as i shared just a few minutes ago praying for the boyd family in tennessee in the loss of First Lady Carol 
Boyd, First Lady Carol Boyd. We're praying for that family. We have you in our prayers, um, Suffolk and Bishop uh, Melvin Boyd and Lady Boyd. God bless you. We're praying for you. Good morning, Sister Verlene and Sister Elaine. The Bible says from the book of Matthew, chapter 9 and verse 35, and going down to verse 38, it says, And Jesus went about all the cities and villages, teaching in their synagogues, and preaching the gospel of the kingdom. The Bible says, And healing every sickness and every disease among the people. But when he saw the multitudes, watch this. When he saw the multitudes, good morning, Sister Ruthie. Good morning, Sister Lisa. When he saw the multitudes, he was moved with compassion. Keep that in your mind. When he saw the multitude, he was moved with compassion on them. Why? Because they fainted and were scattered abroad as sheep having no shepherd. Then saith he unto the disciples, the harvest truly is plenteous, but the laborers are few. Ooh. Pray ye therefore the Lord of the harvest that he will send forth laborers into the harvest. I want you to note some things right there. And that is that Jesus, the Bible says, when he looked upon the people, he was moved with compassion. He was moved at their state of being. I want to say this, and that is never believe that God is not concerned about your situation. Never believe that God does not see your situation. God sees your situation and God feels with you. And if we look at this text, we will find that in time, God will answer. Sometimes God answers immediately and sometimes there is a wait. Why? Only God knows why there is a wait. But then the Bible says, in this instance, when we're praying and we're talking, the Bible says, this is referring to laborers. The coming of laborers as well as it is the one that needs to be ministered unto. Pray ye therefore the Lord of the harvest that he will send forth laborers into his harvest. God has turned our focus in this season on repentance, but not just of the church, but to the one outside of a relationship with God. To the one outside of the relationship with God, the Bible speaks to us and says this, how then shall they call on him whom they have not believed? And how shall they believe in whom they have not heard? And how shall they hear without a preacher? That word right there is to us. Speaking concerning them. I have heard it. I have heard it said and I agree. That the greatest sacrifice that a child of God can make for somebody else is to be willing to stand on the gates of hell to save somebody else from going there. When we look at our text in Matthew, the key word Jesus gives to winning is compassion. Compassion. The word compassion means that the bowels, the inmost part of Jesus what he saw cut him to his core. The Bible says that he began to yearn. He began to crave for the resolution of man's needs. It is important to note that the condition of which Jesus said the people were in, he said they fainted. Not only did they faint, the Bible says that they were scattered scattered abroad as sheep having no shepherd. Sometimes Jesus will allow one to wear himself out completely till you come to the end of your plans and till you come to the end of your natural strength. Come to the end of your strength and, in, and, in, and then make the statement, I yield, I give up. Mark tells the story of a woman, a woman with an issue of blood. The Bible says, who suffered from many 
practitioners are suffering from many physician, physicians. The Bible says she spent all of her money. And even when she spent all of her money, nothing had changed. And then the Bible says, and when she had heard of Jesus, when she hears of Jesus, the Bible says there is a change when she hears of Jesus in her situation and having done all that she could. Now this woman had come to the end of what she had. The Bible even shows us in the book of Luke talking about the prodigal son. What does it say about the prodigal son? The Bible says when he spent all, then the Bible says he came to himself. And then he rose up and came to his father. Hear me. This pandemic is becoming the reality of many coming to themselves and hearts and wheels being receptive to God. Recognizing the need for Jesus. The season is just right for you to win souls. So let's go back to the disciples in Jesus. The Bible said Jesus turned to the disciples. He momentarily looked away from the problem. And he moved his eyes to the solution. I want you to hear that. He moved his eyes away from the problem and moved it to the solution. The problem and the solution was in front of him, but now he focuses on the solution. The solution, the solution was men. Mm. The book of Luke chapter five and verse 10 says it's written when Jesus said to the disciples from henceforth, thou shalt catch men. He turns to men. And in Matthew, Jesus said, behold, I send you forth as sheep in the midst of wolves. Be ye therefore wise as serpents and harmless as doves. Why does Jesus use the analogy of serpents and doves? Jesus uses the analogy of the serpent of being wise because of their skill, because of their carefulness, because of their good aim, because of their forethought. With that attribute, Jesus then says, not only being wise as serpent, but he said, be harmless as dove. Now, while you're being wise as a serpent, what is the attribute of a dove? A dove is friendly. A dove seeks no harm. A dove has the ability to retain information and be creative and productive. That's how. An individual, the Bible says, that's the character that Jesus wants in order for us to win souls. Wise as serpents and harmless as doves. And understanding if a dove has the attribute of being able to retain information and be productive. That sounds like the passage of scripture that says he that winneth souls is what wise. He that winneth souls is wise. I hear the voice of the Lord. That speaks in Isaiah. Yet asking the same question of us today. And that is. Whom shall I send? And who will go for us? Then said I. Here am I. Oh God. Mm -mm -mm. Send me. Can you say that? Who will go for us? Can you say, here am I, send me? <laughs> Hallelujah. Are you willing to stand on the gates of hell to save somebody from going there? Are you willing to reach out to bring somebody else from dying back from death's door? Just as somebody reached out to save you. Are you willing to go the, go the way, go the, go the path in order to bring somebody else back to life? Ah, the prayer assignment this morning is for compassionate laborers with an unquenchable drive to win the loss. 
I'm going to say that again. I'm going to say that again. Our assignment this morning is for compassionate laborers. Compassionate laborers with an unquenchable drive to win the loss. Not only with an unquenchable drive to win the loss, but compassionate laborers that have a fearless disposition. That understand their assignment and will not let go until the assignment is complete. Will not let go. Now you say, when is the assignment complete? The assignment is complete when Jesus comes or when we leave first. Oh God, oh God, come on, yes, yeah. let's enter into his presence with praise and with thanksgiving. Father, great God, in the name of Jesus, ah, worthy is the lamb that was slain. Marvelous is your name. God, we bless you. Oh God, for you are mighty in all of your ways. In the name of Jesus, you sit high, God, and you look low. In the name of Jesus, your hand is not too short that it cannot reach us. God, you and all of your power and all of your greatness, we give you glory. Hallelujah, we give you honor in the name of Jesus. Oh, we enter in, Lord God, to your presence with thanksgiving in the name of Jesus. Because you said to come boldly in the throne of grace that we may obtain mercy and find grace to help in times of need. Father, in the name of Jesus, we recognize in this time of need, God, that you are the only one that is able to turn this thing around in the name of Jesus. Father, and we bless your mighty and your gracious name. You are holy. Hallelujah. And there's no one that is beside you. No one that can compare to you. Oh God, we thank you. We bless your mighty name in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name of Jesus, let the praises of God be in our mouths and a two-edged sword in our hands. Our Father. And our God, in the name of Jesus, awesome in power and awesome in might, worthy are you, Lord, in the name of Jesus, our deliverer, Kenea, our way maker, a lamp unto our feet, in the name of Jesus, and a light unto our path. God, we stand at the door and we knock. In the name of Jesus, you have knocked, Lord God, to get into our, our hearts and God. God, we are available. Now, God, we're knocking in the name of Jesus, asking you, dear God, for your strength and your presence on this morning. Hey, Father, you have never failed us, and God, we don't believe that you ever will. There's not a time, dear God, that you have let us down, and there is not a time, dear God, that we believe that you will let us down. Thank you, God. Hallelujah. Thank you, dear God, for being a very present help. Hey, God, thank Thank you for being present right now in the name of Jesus. Thank you for feeling our atmosphere. Hallelujah. Thank you for feeling the atmosphere where we are in the name of Jesus. From the ceiling to the floor, from wall to wall, God, your presence. You are here and God, we give your name the glory. Hallelujah. Father, we recognize this morning that we need you. In the name of Jesus, we need you not, Lord God, not just your hand. We need you, Lord, not just to give to us. God, we recognize that you are greater than one that gives gives us what we want. But Father, in the name of Jesus, we recognize, Lord God, that we cannot exist without you. We recognize, dear God, that the very breath that we breathe is because of you. Ah, oh God, we need you, Lord, from day to day in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, we recognize that it is you that got us up even this morning. And Father, we call upon your great name. Father, we need you. I hear the song saying, I need you, Lord, I need you. Every hour, dear God, I need you. Oh, bless us now, our Savior. Here we come 
in the name of Jesus. Oh, Father, and I ask you this morning uh, to cleanse us again. Hallelujah. Cleanse us again and create within us a cleaner heart again. In the name of Jesus, hear our prayer again. In the name of Jesus, and God, we thank you. We thank you for hearing us in the name of Jesus. Thank you for responding. You not only hear, but God, you respond. And we say thank you, God. We give your name the glory. Hallelujah. Oh, God, we bless your name. Father, you declared in your word. Hey, God. Hallelujah. In the name of Jesus, to them that receive you. You said, but ye shall receive power. After that, the Holy Ghost has come upon you. Hey, God, and you said, and ye shall be witnesses unto me, both in Jerusalem and in all Judea, and in Samaria, and unto the uttermost part of the earth. Father, in the name of Jesus, you said in your word, to go ye in us, go ye, go ye into all the world and preach the gospel to every creature. Father, you would not send us out there, but not, but send us, Lord God, without power, without strength. Oh God, if we must go, God, don't let us go without you, God, for we understand that in this world, in the name of Jesus, there are many things that come up against the child of God. So God, we ask in you in the name of Jesus to go with us in the name of Jesus. Father, you have opened our eyes. Hallelujah. You have opened our eyes this morning in the name of Jesus to see our part in the kingdom. We have been brought out to, to reach back and to win. Oh God, we have not been spared from things to keep it to ourselves. But Father, we have been made witnesses. Witnesses, Lord God, not only of the things that you've done for us, but witnesses, Lord God, of your might and of your power and of your strength. Witnesses, God, of your good deeds. Hallelujah. Of the things in which you did. Witnesses, Lord God, that you are alive and that you are well. In the name of Jesus. So, Father, in the name of Jesus, remind us, dear God, remind us of where you brought us from and how would we felt when you delivered us and the weight that was lifted upon off of us. Hallelujah. Father, remind us in the name of Jesus. How tired, dear God, we were. Tired of living like we were and wanted out in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, Father, remind us of how we sank so low and how far down your arm had to reach, dear God, in order to pull us up. Father, in the name of Jesus, oh, God, our refusal to see the significance of a Another man's soul, God, will not free us of our responsibility, our responsibility to win in the name of Jesus. Father, care, oh God, in the name of Jesus, bring to our remembrance, oh God, oh God, the sacrifice that you made for us, oh God, that it was not just for us, dear God. Hallelujah, Father, in the name of Jesus. Uh, uh, the reasonable thing that we can do to say thank you is to reach back and get somebody else. Uh, Father, in return, uh, remind us, Lord God, of your question. Who will go for me? Who will go for me? Oh, God, in the name of Jesus, recognizing, dear God, that we don't go by ourselves. Father, you have given us the ability to win, not only to win with our words, but through our lives. Father, may we live a life in the name of Jesus before men, that men will ask the question, what must I do to be saved? Dear God, it's not just about our words of witness God but it's about our life in the name of Jesus not only God about our lives but even dear God the deeds that we do can say dear God hallelujah that we are children of God ha God 
Father, in the name of Jesus, I ask you to stir up the spirit. Hallelujah. Stir up our spirit. Oh, God. Stir up the spirit in the name of Jesus. Of those of us that sit around the table of the word of God. In the name of Jesus. Oh, God. And if we sit around the table of the word of God. And don't share it to lost and dying world. Oh, God. Stir up in our spirit. In the name of Jesus. Give us a hunger, dear God, for souls. A hunger that won't let us go. In the name of Jesus. A hunger that's beyond, Lord God, our household. Beyond our family. Beyond, dear God, our relatives. Oh, God, that sees a dying world. In the name of Jesus. And cannot rest. Uh, that will not allow, oh God, hallelujah, an opportunity to pass, will not allow us to come in contact with somebody and not say something, hey God, about you in the name of Jesus. It is not your will that any should perish. Oh God, help us, Lord God, in this season, in the name of Jesus, to want to take as many to heaven with us in the name of Jesus. That means Dear God, we must share. Hallelujah, we must share you. Oh, Father, in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Okay, and, uh, after all that you have done for us, God, in the name of Jesus, we declare that we are available to you. Hey, God. Hallelujah. Oh, God. We declare we are available to you. So, Father, in the name of Jesus, first give us a heart of compassion. A heart that is concerned about someone, dear God. Someone we may see in the name of Jesus that may face the wrath of you, oh God, and not live eternally with you. Oh God, don't let us rest. Oh God, don't let us rest, dear God, till we share in the name of Jesus. Father, you said that the harvest is ripe. Oh God, the season is here in the name of Jesus, and the power is within us. Oh God, you've given us power in this season. Oh God, no matter what it looks like, you said in the book of Joel, you said, I will pour out upon my flesh in the the last days, oh God, the Bible says in perilous times that you will pour out your spirit. Oh God, you're pouring out your power and your strength in this perilous time in the name of Jesus. Oh God, it's an oxymoron, but the power is here, dear God, for souls to be saved. Father, in the name of Jesus, you have blessed us in more ways, in more ways than one. Oh God, hey! In the name of Jesus, to reach back, may we take all of those tools, dear God, and to reach in the name of Jesus. Father, in the name, stir our hearts even now. Oh God, for those that are even on their way to work, stir up their hearts in the name of Jesus. That when, Lord God, they talk to their co workers today in the name of Jesus, that they will not forget, Lord, to say, something about you. Something, Lord God, in wisdom. In the name of Jesus. Father, give us wisdom. Give us the wisdom needed to reach many. In the name of Jesus. Not the same way, but the but with the same God. In the name of Jesus. Oh, Father. Hey, God. Hallelujah. My God. Oh, God. Father, in the name of Jesus. Give us a sense of urgency urgency. Hallelujah. Oh God, let us sense the urgency in the name of Jesus. Oh God, let us sense the urgency in the name of Jesus. Let us sense the urgency. Hallelujah. Let us sense the urgency. If we don't say something, oh God, that we may be there last 
opportunity to hear. Oh God, we must say something, Gilly. We must say something in the name of Jesus. Father, don't let us be satisfied. Don't let us be satisfied with reaching a few, but keeping reaching until there is no more to reach. Keep on reaching, dear God, until all have come into the knowledge, Lord God, of your saving grace. Father, in the name of Jesus, you told Jeremiah, dear God, and we receive it. Be not afraid of their faces in the name of Jesus. For you, Lord God, are with us to deliver us. Hallelujah. Father, your word declares in the name of Jesus. For God is not unrighteous. Hey, God. Hallelujah in us. Uh, oh God, you're not unrighteous to forget our labor and work of love. Oh God, which you have showed toward us in that ye have ministered to the saints and do minister. Father, in the name of Jesus, uh, your word declares, say, uh, Oh, God, your word declares, hallelujah, for what is our hope, our joy, our sour crown of boasting before our Lord Jesus at his coming. It is you, Yemasea, it is you, dear God, that we have reached back for, uh, for you are the glory and joy in the name of Jesus. Oh, Father, we thank you. Can I say, Bosha? Thank you for choosing us in the name of Jesus. Thank you for choosing us to represent you in the earth. Ah, oh, God is your voice of comfort. Thank you for choosing us to represent you in the earth as your voice of love. Ah, oh, God. Oh, God. Thank you for choosing us to represent you in the earth. Your voice of appeal. Thank you for choosing us to represent you in the earth. Your voice of direction. Eh, hey, God. Thank you for choosing us to represent in the earth your voice of compassion father in the name of Jesus we thank you dear God that this hour dear God hallelujah hey God that you are using us in the name of Jesus and in this season oh God to tell men and women dear God about your goodness about your mercy dear God and about your grace and God for this we give you the glory Moshe. hey God in the name of Jesus I ask you dear God hallelujah to give us a yielded heart a yielded mind in the name of Jesus hallelujah oh God and for this dear God we give your name the praise and father in the name of Jesus oh God we intercede we intercede dear God for souls in the name of Jesus oh God hallelujah for those Lord that are on the altar even now seeking Lord God your face oh Oh God, it is your will, dear God, to fill them with your spirit. Oh God, we pray in the name of Jesus for Kiana, for Bobby, God, for Miss Kopich. We pray for Miss Bay, for Miss Cowan, for the Irvin sisters. We pray, Lord God, for Marlene, for Mercedes, for Janie, for Jeanette. We pray, Lord God, for the elder El Edwards family. Oh God, those that are seeking your face in the name of Jesus. I pray, dear God, for every unsaved family member, Lord God, that uh, of, of those that are on the prayer line even now, those, Lord God, that are on Facebook Live, I pray, dear God, that you stir up their hearts and stir up their minds. In the name of Jesus, oh God, let us be a witness before them. Hallelujah. Witness, Lord God, of your ability to save. In the name of Jesus. And Father, 
Father, right now, oh God, we give you glory. And Father, we lay before you in the name of Jesus. We lay before you, Sue Seals. Oh God, in the name of Jesus, bring her through the exam. We lay before you, dear God, the Ballard and the Lockett family. We lay before you, dear God, Lindsay Ballard. Oh God, we lay before you, John, John, and Justin. Uh, God, we lay before you, Errol and Addis Joseph. Father, we lay before you in the name of Jesus. Paris and Isaac. Oh God, Mr. and Mrs. Barbarak. In the name of Jesus, we lay before you, Darlene Pearson. Oh God, I wonder in the name of Jesus. God, we lay before you, Monica Allen. Oh God, for complete healing. For Zion Austin, Zary and Alvin III. The Ware family, Charles, Terrence, and Felicia. God, we lay before you, Evangelist Jackie and Doris Scott. Oh, God, for Jenny Ann Newton, Joyce Wormsley, Ken, Matt, and Kaylin, and Victoria, Tymira Dubois. Oh, God, Kasia and Cynthia. Oh, God, hallelujah for all of the unsaved. In the name of Jesus, for our bereaved families, we lay before you, God, Evangelist Chris. Williams, in the name of Jesus, God, I ask you to strengthen her today. Hallelujah. We pray, Lord God, for Mother Gladys Neal, for Leslie Johnson, Evangelist Veronica Cunningham, Kyle Flowers, Trina Tate Dublin Aaron, Jeff Pyle, oh God, Don Simmons, James and Jeffrey, Ma Maj and the girls, oh, Angie Robinson, Father Harold and Deborah Lash, Jimmy Hauser, Charles Wesley, Robert Taylor, Alan Cross Sr., Ken Hicks, God, John Lindsay, George family, oh God, Gabby Ivory, Jasota and Journey, in the name of Jesus, oh God, Brother Howard, Elon for a, uh, and, and the CMI, CCA, and TPC family, oh God, Mr. Blue and Mother Mora, Jared and the three children, the Bush and, and Jones family, Harold Wetzel and Valley Central Church, Scott Taylor and Brown family, family, James and Douglas Morris, Tamala Ingram and family, Mr. Hilton, Mr. Brown, Tommy, Chelsea, Marriages, Arilla and Golder family, Elder Roy and Nicole Woods and family, oh God, Christina Richardson, the missing 10 year old girl, the Perry family, Sydney and Simone, Lorna, Misha, God, Catherine, Heather and Zipporah, the Perry family, the Williams and Turner family, Oh God, those in emergency rooms and right now. God, remember Joseph and Zare and Rhonda. Aretha Hutchins' mother. In the name of Jesus. Jasmine and Elaine family. Jasmine Elaine family. Carol and Joshua. Shin and Jean. All of the children and grandchildren. The Turner Johnson and Mitchell family. Oh God, Vernon and Josie Smith. Michael Gamble. Kip Holmes. Oh God, Shayla Bright and Brandon, God, Leron Rainey, God, and ask you in the name of Jesus uh, to bring him to full health. Uh, Mary Nolan, for our missing children, missing and abused children, uh, oh God, the Fagans and Floods, uh, Nicole Wade family, Aaron Sims, uh, Crystal Calvin, Keisha and Tamara, Luana, Angela, Wayne, and the children in the name of Jesus, uh, oh God, uh, Luana in the name of Jesus, the children that returning to school, the entire Griffin family, uh, oh God, uh, the Merritt Thompson Robinson family, uh, Jameson Howe family, Mother Gwen Smith, uh, Jasmine and Sean, uh, Christian and Michael Brown, uh, oh God, uh, the mothers Wallace, Joseph Green, Savage, Phillips and Smith, uh, oh God, William Brown, uh, Candace, Camille, Ashley, Kayla, Courtney, Gabrielle, after the third, uh, Alvin in the name of Jesus, the Morgan family, 
Hallelujah. Oh God, in the name of Jesus, Mother Bernice Mason, Dr. Gutierrez, Shirley Smith, essential workers, Teresa Sanders, Pastor Thomas Gaines, Pastor Robert Moore, Evangelist Yvonne Milton, Mr. Elliot Graves, Glenda Gilchrist, Cheryl Rose, Jean Thompson, in the name of Jesus, Stephen Herring, oh God, Janice Ballard, in the name of Jesus, school teachers, the Ford family, our college students, oh God, those that are in the nursing home, oh God, remember the homeless this morning, in the name of Jesus, remember our veterans, God, remember Latrice, oh God, all of our businesses, in the name of Jesus, all those, Lord God, that are without employment, that are looking for employment, I ask you, dear God, to open the door today, in the name of Jesus, so that they may be able to provide for their families, God, I pray for Sister L. Taylor, oh God, for Weston and William, in the name of Jesus, for Damon and Arisha, oh God, and for Shanae, God, I pray for Elaine Wilson, in the name of Jesus, I pray, Lord God, for Sister Sherry, in the name of Jesus, heal her body, oh God, heal her body, from the top of her head, dear God, to the sole of her feet, in the name of Jesus, oh God, you're able, I pray, Lord God, for Jess and Tiny this morning, in the name of Jesus, I ask you, dear God, oh God, to strengthen her, oh God, in leading in the name of Jesus, I pray, dear God, for all of our mothers, oh God, in this morning, our single mothers, Father, in the name of Jesus, I ask you, oh God, to help, Lord God, hallelujah, send help in the name of Jesus, oh God, send mentors that are able to give positive counsel in the name of Jesus, oh God, and able to help the single mother, the single father in the name of Jesus, I pray, Lord God, for Bobby, Betty, Eugene, and children, for financial relief, for, for Princess Quintana Tate, God, I pray for Lisa Wallace, Sherry in the name of Jesus, Mary Williams and family, Mother Proctor and family, oh God, break the strongholds on our families, hallelujah, on the minds in the name of Jesus, oh God, and you get the glory. Father, in the name of Jesus, uh, Melba, in the name of Jesus, uh, we're declaring and decreeing that it is so. Oh, God, uh, every name, dear God, uh, hallelujah, that comes across the screen, uh, every name, dear God, that's on the mind of your people, in the name of Jesus, uh, you're able to do exceeding abundantly above all that we can ask or think. Uh, go beyond, Lord God, what we ask for, and you know the need of the person, dear God, uh, that is above what we even say it is, but Lord God, you know everything about the situation, and Father, we give it into your hands, and God, we ask you to work a miracle, work a miracle in lives, work a miracle in the bodies, in the name of Jesus, those Lord God that are experiencing symptoms of COVID-19, God, I ask you in the name of Jesus to reverse it. Oh God, to reverse it in the name of Jesus. Oh God, I pray, Lord God, for those, Lord, that are trying to breathe in the name of Jesus. I ask you, Lord God, to allow them to breathe on their own. Bring them back in the name of Jesus in full health and in full strength. Oh God, we give you all the glory. And Father, we declare and decree that it is so. In the name of Jesus, even for the Brown family, we declare it is so. For Ursa Thomas and family, we declare it is so. Come on, help me seal this prayer in the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. Believing God, it is done. Hey, and I'm Messiah. For Avanisha Housley, in the name of Jesus. For Faye Clemens, it's done. It is so. Oh, God, healing even from leukemia. It is so. All forms of cancer in the name of Jesus. It is so. Oh, yeah. Anasa Todd Mills, it is so. In the name of Jesus. Hallelujah. We declare it is so. Uh, God, and we give your name the glory. Now, Father, in the name of Jesus, I even pray for our intercessors. Oh, God, in the name of Jesus, the one that is dealing with pain right now, dear God, I ask you, Lord, to go to the root of the pain in the name of Jesus and address the root of the pain. Oh, God, heal, Lord God, oh, not just the body, but heal the mind. Heal the White House in the name of Jesus. Oh, God, hallelujah. 
hallelujah man say hallelujah in the name of jesus we declare and decree that it's done it is done it is done it is done and we seal it with the praise hallelujah we seal it with the praise 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 come on seal it come on seal it seal it seal it seal it ha thank you god thank you god thank you god thank you thank you thank you thank you thank you come on seal it seal it seal it seal it seal it in the name of jesus we bless your name and we declare it to be so in the name of jesus in the name of jesus in the name of jesus in this oh god hallelujah hallelujah hey god and it is so. Hear my say. In Jesus' name, make us out of my shell. Oh, God. Hallelujah.